Hello, Brawl Nation. You ready to take your battles up a level? Then grab your Bakugan, because this Brawler how-to is coming in hot. Welcome to your intermediate training guide to the all-new Bakugan. Okay, Brawlers, it's time to take the battle to a whole new level. In level one, we covered the basics of Bakugan and got you started with the simplest kinds of Bakugan battles. Level two is all about adding strategy to the mix. And like before, the first thing we're gonna need to battle is a few Bakugan. And as always, at least one of your figures has to be the type that rolls. Now this is where things start to get interesting. If you remember from level one, in a Bakugan battle, each player gets to brawl with three figures. But what if you own more than three Bakugan? And let's be honest, if you're watching this video, you probably already do. Well, then comes the strategy of choosing your Bakugan Bakugan figures for battle. You already know about regular Bakugan and special attack figures, but did you know that every Bakugan also has a number score? It's true. Bakugan all have a point value, and when you're battling like an intermediate brawler, you've built your lineup to maximize your point potential. Optimizing your Bakugan for battle gets even more strategic when you consider the compatibility of your various figures. Whether you've got traditional Bakugan or the spinning special attack type, Every Bakugan figure is customizable, so you can combine and brawl your figures, and each new combination will offer a different score in battle. Now the first thing you need to know about scoring your battle is that every Bakugan comes with a corresponding character card or special attack card that add together to determine its score. Regular Bakugan character cards look like this, and special attack Bakugan cards look like this. Like in level one, we'll be transforming our Bakugan on the magnetic gate cards. Each brawler should place two of their gate cards face up in the battle area, forming a two by two grid. If you're not playing with this sweet new Bakugan battle arena, you can just set your gate cards up on any flat surface. Once you have that done, set your three character cards paired with their special attack cards if necessary, next to the matching toys. Then brawlers roll or spin their Bakugan onto the magnetic gate cards at the same time. Three, two, one, Bakugan brawl! A Bakugan score is based on what area of the gate card they land on, highlighted here. Each Bakugan has three scores, red power, green power, and blue power. You determine your Bakugan score by comparing the area it transforms on on the gate card with your Bakugan's character card, adding the special attack card points if you used a special attack Bakugan. For example, if this special attack Bakugan landed on a red area of the gate card, we total the red points for our score, 500. Nice. If a Bakugan lands on the border between two icons, the player whose Bakugan it is gets to choose which icon to use. If one Bakugan fails to open or doesn't open on a gate card and the other one does, the Bakugan that opens on a gate card automatically wins. If both Bakugan fail to open or don't open on the gate cards, players roll again. The Bakugan with the highest score wins that brawl. To win the Bakugan battle, you've got to beat your opponent in a brawl with each of your three Bakugan. And that's about it, Einstein. Intermediate brawlers take the Bakugan battle to a whole new level. But before we send you off to battle on your own, let's do a quick review of level two. Bakugan battles are won and lost based on score. Every Bakugan comes with a character card, and special attack figures also come with a special attack card that helps you determine score. Your final score depends on your Bakugan scoring potential and where your Bakugan lands on the gate cards. To win a Bakugan battle, you've got to beat your opponent in a brawl with each of your three Bakugan. Booyah! Now you're ready to get brawling. Congratulations on passing the Bakugan Brawler's level two training video. We encourage you to keep pushing the limits of your attack and adding strategy to the way you brawl. When you're ready to attempt black belt level Bakugan brawling, check back with us for the Bakugan Brawler's level three training video, where we'll unlock everything the battle has to offer. Bakugan brawl!